Can you guess which Norwegian inventions you have tons of at home? <laughs> they are frugal, down to earth, and very pragmatic, just like we are. And these are the six best inventions from Norway, making your everyday life better and much easier. So what are the Norwegian inventions? Our contribution to the world of inventions? Well, they are not as groundbreaking as the wheel. They are not as glamorous as electricity. They are small, almost invisible, but they are making your life a little bit easier, a little bit better. Norway is a rich country. Absolutely, but are we a smart country? I mean, we are rich from oil, so I'm not sure if we are rich on brain power. Well, you tell us. Number one, and uh, that's uh, maybe the biggest commercial invention. It's about your plants, it's about your garden, it's about your farm, and it's also about huge industries. Oh, bananas! <laughs> well, we didn't invent bananas. Oranges. But you are close to it. We invented something that made it grow faster, grow up to be more luscious and give more. Our number six is fertilizer, artificial fertilizer. What is that? That's what you put in the uh, earth to uh, fertilize the ground and the earth. Why is in that? In Norway, a... I mean, we have dark winters. I, nothing grows here. So it was... A potatoes mess. grow. Yeah, potatoes, yes. But it was... But a, nearly. It, almost, yeah. But it was a necessity for us to invent something that made us able to grow more so we could have more food. I think that that was it. Very pragmatic. And that made uh, everyone have vegetables on the table. Absolutely in Norway. Even bananas, even oranges, even though it doesn't grow in Norway. But our fertilizer, artificial fertilizer, is all over the world made known by a Norwegian company called the Yara. Mm. Very luscious. Okay, uh, number five. In Norway, our culture is concentrated around the well-being of children. So, we... In oh, prison! <laughs> no, we didn't invent, invent prison. But uh, we invented something that will make uh, your life as a parent and your life as a child easier. I mean... Okay, if I was a child and I was having dinner, I had to be at the table and a chair like this would be too big for me. And if my parents placed me up here, I could whoa, fall down or it wouldn't be safe. And no more responsibility. No, so uh, we looked at that problem. Hmm, what can we do? And Eureka, Eureka, we invented the trip trap uh, chair. Trip trap? Trip trap. It's an easy construction. It's an invention where you can make the chair suitable for kids in all ages. As they grow older, you just. Uh, just uh, uh, you just. Uh, yeah, put them on another yeah, level. level. It yeah, seems yeah. like a chair. Yeah, you adjust the you levels. Start at yeah. the As you can see floor, here, you go, oh, very, man. very, very easy. Very simple, but very smart invention, if you have kids. <laughs> uh, okay, N number three on our list is about cleaning and cleaning windows. Because Norway is a very dark and gloomy country and daylight is m very important for us. That also our homes are very important and we love to keep it clean just like you guys and we love to clean our windows but before this invention it could be very dangerous to clean uh, a window you could break your neck like this you were cleaning 
you were happy. Yeah, and then you wanted to take the other side and you fall down. No, 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 because no. you couldn't come outside with your rug. If, if you try to get outside, you would end up there. No, yeah, no, you would no, fall. No, no. So number three on our uh, great inventions from Norway is the age window. Oh, now she yes. survived. So you can clean both sides of the windows just by turning it. From inside? Yes, it was a revolution. You can stand outside. Nobody has to go outside or do anything. You just turn your window. You have the outside, outside uh, in and you wash it. And it has revolutionized uh, window cleaning all over the world. Is it an, uh, like an export article? It is. The age window. We are proud of it. I'm not sure if you know what I'm talking about, but we don't care. And this is the most typical, I would say, Norwegian invention. And if you know somebody that are in Norway, have visited you, have studied there, and they will bring you a souvenir, I think most of uh, the people will bring this. It has something to do with our uh, Protestantic background. This is a cheese. And what's the problem? What's our invention? Well. Uh, in other countries, like Spain or something, they use a knife and they take this cheese oh, like yes, this. Yes, yeah. big mm. fat slices. But in Norway, it's a sin. Why? Because we are not, we don't want to eat too much. Food is a scare oh. thing. I remember when this invention came, there was a war from no. the producers. No. Oh, you are overspending, it's going to be a mess. Yeah. This is not a Norwegian way of eating. This is too much. It's too indulging. So this invention created a riot. Yeah. The cheese slicer, made famous around the world by IKEA. What does it do? Well, it makes your cheese like this more suitable cheese. for a mart pakke, suitable for an open uh, sandwich, and really not uh, too much in it. It's thin, and, you're supposed to have and you only need two of these to have on an open sandwich. Okay, then you're filled, and then this one will last for a year. We claim that this is from Norway and it has something to do with your papers, your uh, 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 passion for organizing, for not losing things. The pen. Uh, no, that is more groundbreaking. Not the pencil, not the post-its. And not the post-it. Xerox machines. And uh, not either. Too technical for a Norwegian. No, we saw that there were problems with uh, sheets like this all over. And then we say that a Norwegian was looking at this problem and thinking, hmm, Eureka! This, a paper clip. Okay, no loose ends, no more disorganized. Very pragmatic and absolutely not shouting anything. It's not a glamorous thing. What is this? It's, it's just a, a bent. Uh, yeah. But for one reason or another, I don't know, maybe some of you know, and then subscribe, push the bell, and write us the story if you are from UK. Why in the world are UK guys? wanting to claim this invention. Can you not let us Norwegian? And we have nothing. We are a small country. We are, I mean, living in a winter. Can we not have the paper clip? Yeah, UK people, uh, you can give us that one. But because this is so close to our heart. This makes us proud, this small little invention. Typical, typical Norwegian. It has to be Norwegian Mats, don't you think? I think it is. It has nothing to do with the crowd no. or anything. The crowd can go. No. I, I, you can go. No, home. no. Is it, Mats, is it enough volume in my hair? I'm not sure. I, I feel it's a little bit flat. It is. Don't you think? Hmm. Yes.
Me Go too. Your yeah, okay. And fix your hair. Uh, You're off. The number one invention in Norway, and this is a groundbreaking, of course, Norwegian would say that, best seller. This is the most sold Norwegian invention all over the world. The and atom I'm sure... bomb. The atom bomb. <laughs> no. And it's not sal salmon either, really, it, it isn't. And it's not oil, it could be an oil platform, but who cares, you don't have that in your home. Vaccine. I wish. No, the number one, the best seller, and I would say revolutionizing your hairstyle. Because the, the most right. sold, and this is uh, super hold extreme hairstyle gloss, it's not the content or the ingredients because it could be paint, it could be uh, something against mosquitoes, it could be for your hair or it could be for your uh, graffiti art. Uh, I think most of you use it for your hair. Spray cans, they are from Norway. And what? how many of these in Norwegian inventions do you have in your home? <laughs> I'm sure you have 10 of these. So, but most Norwegians don't really know that this is a Norwegian invention. So Why it's... Why did it feel like we needed this? I'm not sure, because Norwegians are not that vain. <laughs> we are not that no. glamorous, but we love to paint. So maybe, I don't know, but spray cans? Oh, it's the best seller invention in Norwegian invention in the world. Okay, guys, which of these inventions do you like most? Do you need most in your life? You know what to do? Subscribe, push the bell, and really Enjoy the share. Community. Yeah, share your stories and read stories from other subscribers and other people around the world. And I push the bell and all notifications. Absolutely. On. And I have one last question. What's the most famous inventions from your country? Yeah, if you know. Okay, that was it. See you soon. Bye bye. You can use this one. Here. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Goodbye. Oh. Goodbye. Is it. Do you see the volume? I think I need more. Uh, but this is pain. <laughs> no!